Let's talk about the second round pick. Um, to me, this second round pick is not, it's obviously not as important as the first round pick because the first round pick is like three years of picks in one. But in the short term, at least, it, it's just as important. It's, 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 let's just say it's extremely important. Uh, and I have some reasons. But why do you think, in your opinion, this second round pick, what's at stake here? Wow. In the next few years, we should draft as good as we can in the second round. And uh, it's mainly because we just gave up two more first round picks for, for this year to draft. Yeah, good point. And uh, this team has more holes than, than most of the people think uh, they have. Um, those holes are in the offensive line, in the secondary, uh, and, and we should we should keep up uh, the pace with other teams and uh, just draft guys in later rounds for, for those positions, for offensive guard, offensive tackle, cornerback, later safeties. So every uh, later round picks in the next few years will be important. And this year uh, is also crucial because uh, there are some great talents in the second round. Uh, we should consider uh, who we are going to draft. All right. I, I'm hearing you on that one. Tell me if you agree with me on this. It seems to me that if the Niners take any quarterback at three, there's a, a high a high chance, a high likelihood that that player doesn't even play next season. They've already said that their preferred scenario is to sit the sit the rookie for a year. Let him develop on the bench the way Patrick Mahomes did, the way Tom Brady did, and play Jimmy Garoppolo for one more season. We can debate whether that's smart or not, and we will later. <laughs> But that's their plan that they're saying publicly. If that's the case, then they're not going to get any production from their rookie first round pick in 2021. And they're considering themselves Super Bowl contenders. They want to make a run. So that second round pick needs to produce. Yeah. Right away. Got to be. And like, he doesn't necessarily need to start, but there are some roles on the team that are like pseudo starters that are open, like uh, the number three receiver. You know what I'm saying? That guy yeah. plays more than Kyle Juszczyk. The Niners don't have anyone. They have Richie James, who they don't trust. They have Jalen Hurd, who can't play consistently. And that's it. They got Travis Benjamin, too. Uh, so it seems like, I don't know, they could take a wide receiver who could be the number three guy. They could take a corner who could start ahead of Emmanuel Mosley. Whoever they take there needs to play a lot, a lot, a lot. 